How to be a hot mess. Whether you aspire to be a hot mess or want to know what exactly a hot mess is so you'll never be called one, these guidelines will help. You will need tight clothes, a bad hairstyle, tacky makeup, a tan, and alcohol. Step one, figure out what your ideal dress size is, then squeeze into clothes that are two sizes smaller than that. Step two, wear your bottoms low and your tops high so you'll always have a muffin top, even if you're not overweight. Pair ripped pantyhose with hot pants and always wear shoes too high for you to walk in gracefully. Step three, find a hairstyle befitting a hot mess. Choices include clip-on extensions that don't hide the clips very well, a fried perm, a mullet, a reverse mullet, or hair bumped up three inches at the crown. To be a really hot mess, combine two or more of these hairstyles. Step four, wear the right makeup, non-waterproof mascara, blue eyeshadow, and lip liner darker than your lipstick. No need for foundation thanks to your tan. Either lie in a tanning bed until your skin is the texture and color of well-done bacon, or pile on the fake stuff that turns you orange. Step five, drink too much. Lose your lunch in public. Swear you'll never drink again. Repeat the next day. Step six, master any one of these steps and you'll be a hot mess. Put them all together and a whole new hot mess category will have to be invented for you. Did you know hot mess is believed to have originated from the image of a steaming dog pile? <laughs>